Hi guys, it's me. Um, I have a whole video. Hold on, somebody wants to visit. Look how big he's getting. He is getting huge. Huge, huge, huge. See, look, look at these balls. I'll show you how big he's going to be. But isn't he so pretty? Isn't oh, my baby so pretty? Oh, Cody. Look at yourself on TV. Look at you. Oh, look at you. You're so pretty. Oh, that's a pretty boy he is. Oh. Oh. You going to stay here while I do this? Um, went to uh, Tuesday morning today because everybody's been talking about the stance at Tuesday morning. And um, asked my hubby and he let me go. Um, was able to pick up some stance. And they didn't have all the ones that I have seen people have that I wanted. But um, I'm kind of glad because they had some paper there too that I wanted. So that way I didn't spend all my money on stamps. But, um, sorry. <laughs> um, but I did get some really cute stuff. Uh, I'll show that to you here. Um, the first thing I got um, was a pad of, it says, I guess there's 12 sheets in here. A 12 by 12 paper by TPC Studio. The name of it is Little Lovin' Brains and Words. Yeah, but it says like, miss you, love birds, you are my everything, soulmates, I will always love you, all my love, you are my sunshine, uh, amour, best friend, until the end of time, love, miss you, um, love birds, soulmates, forever and ever, but I thought that was really cute paper, I got that, I got this one, which is really cool, and it came with 25 pieces, but I think it's a double pack. I think I got two of them, um, and it wasn't supposed to be like that, but it says its original price was $17.25, and I got it for $1.99. It's TPC Studio, and it's Mediterranean Summer Alhambra. There's the one. That's it. That's what it looks like. And then um, it says I'm only supposed to get 25 sheets, but it looks like there's two pads there, so I think I got a good deal on that one. So, got that. Then I got this one, which is TPC Studio also. It's called Great Outdoors Canteen Stripe. I got this because we just went um, to the cabin last weekend. And I took some cute pictures of Cody at the cabin. So, um, I have I had to get this paper. It was really pretty. And it was $1.99, and you get 25 sheets. And there's the front. There's the back. So I got that. And then, of course, because I have Cody now, I had to get some wolf paper, but I also got it for Coco and Maggie, too. Um, but it's from TPC Studio, Bad to the Bone, Play Ball. And I think you get 25 sheets of this one, too, and it was $1.99. That was my favorite. Oh, oh, so pretty. Yes. And then another one of the TPC Studios, um, 99 cent pack for 12 of them, it says. But it looks, again, like I got two pads of it. So I think I got 24 sheets. There's the front. And there's heart there. And then there's the back. You want to go? Okay. Um, and then I got this one. I don't really like the mask. I'm not a big fan of it. Or I don't know if this is the mask. Or it looks like it is. But it says Girlfriend Brocade. And it's TPC Studio. I'm not a big fan of it. I got it for a friend because I know she loves black and white. So I got this. It was 99 cents. And it's 12 sheets. Um, I got three pads of the Autumn Leaves cardstock, 12 by 12 white cardstock, 35 pieces for $1.99, and it originally says it was $24.50, so I got three pads of that for $1.99. Then I got the Autumn Leaves 8 by 8 cardstock, and it was $1.99, yeah, it said it was really originally $4.99. It had tons of other stuff there that I wanted, but I had to behave myself. I was put on a limit, which was a good thing, because if I wouldn't have been put on that limit, I probably would have came out with the whole store, because they had, like, a whole, it's not even the scrapbooking section, it was, like, right as you walk in the door, they had, like, an end pack, and it was just full of these new stamps that everybody's been getting, and the paper pads, the TPC Studio is the big thing, it seems like, and Stampology, I think, to be honest with you. Um, that's that new international. Is that who makes it, Courtney? International? That iced coffee? Is it international? Who makes that? 
whoever makes it. It's the new um, iced coffee that you can buy like in a carton. And this is the vanilla. It's really, really good. So, sorry to be rude though. Okay, so I got a few stamps. Um, I got the TPC Studio Back to School. I was looking for these, hoping I could find them, but um, my daughter will start preschool next week, and I want to, like, scrapbook her. Hopefully, it, it's an eventful first day. I'm sure it's going to be eventful, but I'm hoping it turns out to be a good day, because she doesn't want to go. Um, most kids, like, are excited about going to school, but my daughter doesn't want to go. She doesn't like to hear about it. She doesn't want anything to do with it. So we'll see whether I get to scrapbook anything or not, because she'll probably be crying in every picture I take. Um, I got these. These are the football ones. I'm so excited to find these. I saw these in Coco Drop, his video, and I was hoping I could find these because we're huge, huge, huge Steeler fans. And um, my nephew is now playing football too, so I took a few pictures of him the last game I went to. So I, I'd like to scrap that for my sister. So I thought those stamps were pretty cool. I got the circus one. It's really cool. And I got the coffee cafe. I love this. One. And um, the cheerleader. I thought that one was really cool. I was a cheerleader when I was in. My daughter cheered when she was younger, so I have some pictures of her. So I figured I could use them. I probably only use them, you know, every so often, but um, like it just brings back memories. I cheered my whole life. I cheered since I was five years old, so I was a senior in high school. Then cheered in college, and you know, I cheered a lot. And I hope that my daughter doesn't want to cheer. Most people, most women want, if they were a cheerleader, or if they weren't a cheerleader, they want their daughter to cheer so they can, like, follow in the footsteps they never did. But, um, I'm, like, the complete opposite. I do not want, I pray she doesn't want to cheer, because I had enough of it in high school, and I don't think I could stand any more of it. Um, I, I hope she, I don't know. I want her to get in a sport, but I don't know what sport she'll get into, because she wants to play soccer, but my husband's not a big fan of soccer, so, because he thinks soccer is kind of silly, because you can't touch the ball, and he just thinks it's a silly sport, but my niece is a huge, huge, um, she's a goalkeeper for a varsity team, and she's only a freshman, actually, no, she's a sophomore this year, forgot, and, um, she's, Super, they went to states, and um, she, now they didn't win states, they went all the way to states, but they didn't win, they did lose, but um, she got them all the way to states, and yeah, she's really good, and every year here, our newspapers do like a, a local write-up about who's who to watch, like in different sports, and uh, like the high school team, and my niece this year got picked as a who's who to watch in soccer, so I thought that was pretty cool. So I'll be able to use some of these because, like, some of them say, like, team and victory and varsity. She plays on a varsity team and spirit and, like, you know, some of those other ones, you know, that are just plain I can use. But the other ones I'll use for, like I said, my daughter did cheer and my niece cheered when they were little. And I had my fill. I'm done. I don't want any more cheerleading, but I just thought I'd use them, and they were only two dollars. So, um, this is the one I went searching for, and I was so excited to find the license plate. And it was, I was so excited when I saw it. I'm like, yay, they have it. I don't even know why I want it so bad, but it's really cute. I think what I'm going to do is make license plates for all of our bikes. And um. Uh, I have to figure out a way to do it. I, I, I probably could cut it out in metal, um, but I'd have to find the die. But um, I thought this was a really cool can, so I got that one. And the last one I got, this one is so cool. Um, like I told you, we went to um, camp this past weekend to a cabin, and this is. And I told you I, I'd never seen elk before, and they had elk there, but um. This is like, it's called The Great Outdoors, and it's a uh, camping and fishing and um, roughing it, so we kind of roughed it, really didn't rough it. I mean, this cabin was like a mansion, 
but it was it was fun. It was nice to be there. Very relaxing, especially after I broke my foot. Um, but that is my haul. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I guess that's it. I do um, Coco Drop if you're watching this. I don't know if you watch my videos, but if you are watching this, um, I did send you a message about the punches that I have and stamps that I would like. So if you could get back to me, that'd be great. See ya. Bye.